Ladies and gentlemen, make no mistake, free speech is under attack here in America. The Biden regime continuously uses different methods to try to silence dissenting voices. All are co a coordinated effort to keep power, silence the truth, and prevent people who disagree with them from having a voice. We know that the White House colluded with big tech to censor the American people. We know that the Department of Justice tried to silence moms and dads by calling them domestic terrorists just for having a say in their children's education and attending school board meetings. And we know that conservative journalists have been targeted by federal agencies for simply reporting the truth. And this cannot continue. We're here today to advocate for my bill, the Protecting Free Speech Act, which will terminate the new DHS Department uh, Disinformation Governance Board. Now, the DHS, this is a militant arm of the government. They have enforcement mechanisms for their disinformation governance board. We want to ensure that no tax dollars are used for any similar government overreach. Misinformation has become a rally cry for the left to discredit facts that are inconvenient to their liberal agenda. The Russia collusion hoax, Hunter Biden's laptop, the COVID lab leak theory were all labeled misinformation by big tech until the truth finally prevailed. Meanwhile, the Biden regime has been able to put out ridiculous statements that we all know to be lies. This includes false claims like our southern border is secure. No, in fact, there's a complete invasion at our southern border. More than two million illegal aliens coming into our country, some 700,000 gotaways coming into our country, our children dying from the fentanyl that is illegally coming into our country. False claims also that Republicans wanted to defund the police and that Biden's Build Back Better Act, which the nonpartisan Congressional Research Service estimated would cost $3 trillion over 10 years, somehow cost the American taxpayer zero dollars. You can't really make this stuff up. So now, because the Biden regime is afraid of Elon Musk and free speech, they want to use American tax dollars to fund this new board to continue to silence conservatives. Look, I wouldn't trust Biden and his incompetent misfits to take care of one of my goats. And I certainly don't trust them to be the arbiters of truth. You know who I do trust? I trust the American people. They are more capable of looking at claims, researching facts, making informed decisions. Americans don't need big tech fact checkers or this partisan board silencing free speech like communist China does. I'm calling on Congress to pass my Protecting Free Speech Act, terminate this Orwellian Ministry of Truth, fire Needham Jankowitz, and prevent the Biden regime from silencing the American people. And with that, I would like to turn this over to my good friend from Louisiana, Mr. Whip Steve Scalise.